I try to level the build plate. I got the feeler gauge here. Oh, no. Let's see. A one point. Uh, zero point one millimeter. I try to. Here is exactly there and then right there, and I have a dial indicator. I just move it on the same spot. There, bring it. No, I will. Where is it? There? It's right here, and we go to the next one here. Let's see. And now I got about the same height. Still zero on the dial indicator, and that's mean it's zero point one. Uh, now I go to one corner. Uh, here it's still one right, and now it's dipping a lot. Uh, I don't see the dial indicator. It used to be. Here is zero, and now it's about here, and that's one corner. Let's see if we go back to the middle, and it's they are lost. Checking point and so it's down on zero and I will go to the corner and you see it's moving away. this corner and when it hits the middle you see it's in zero position and we go to this corner and you can see the gauge is far away from center over here and you can see the gauge will but it's still far from leveled. Well, I'm back and let's see if you can see. Uh, the center is higher than the back corner and the front corner. Here you can actually see uh, how bad it is. Let's see. Point feeling gauge. I will put this in the corner here and uh, it should be able to do this, but as you can see, uh, still when I have this, I have no problem to get this out. Uh, you can actually see. see the gap here. Yeah, 
Let's and we'll show you something else uh, if you look close here. I can move the carriage without moving uh, uh, the belt about one millimeter something so it's bad uh, sometimes they are stuck and you need to push them around to get them working also I one of these bolts was missing so I took one the back and put it here I hope this uh, video will sort things out